All right, so we're going to do something fun. You, why is Eddie up here? Well, I'm glad you asked. We're going to start off with something fun this morning. How many of you know that church can be fun and should be fun? Amen. Come on. We're the people of God, and there's a lot to celebrate. And uh, contrary to uh, popular religious belief, we can laugh and have fun in church. Amen. I heard a guy say one time, he was like, church should be fun. It, it should be funner than hell. And it's, <laughs> and it's really true, right? Oh, that was bad already right there. So here's, here's, here's what we're doing. This is a dad joke challenge. These are some really, really funny, intelligent jokes that we're about to tell you guys. Easy on the intelligence part. <laughs> <laughs> so we're going to try to make each other laugh with these um, amazing dad jokes, all right? Hopefully you guys get a kick out of it as well. So you guys watch. Help us keep score. How often can I make Pastor Eddie laugh with my cheesy dad jokes, all right? So here we go. Pastor Eddie, what do you call a fake noodle? I don't know. An impasta. <laughs> All right. What did the mountain climber name his son? Cliff. <laughs> <laughs> what do you call an elephant who doesn't matter? Irrelevant. <laughs> what do you call a man with a rubber toe. Roberto. <laughs> in Espanol. <laughs> yeah, I'm Mexican. You got to get that in there. <laughs> what did the grape do? The grape, like the fruit. <laughs> <laughs> got him to laugh already. That's, well, that's like bonus There's another right there. type of thing called a grape. <laughs> that's not a fruit. <laughs> what did the grape do when it was stepped on? He let out a little wine. Okay, this is non-religious. What do you call an overweight psychic? A four-chin teller. <laughs> oh, oh, I see what you did four there. Four chin, chins. Yeah. Four chins. Four chin teller. <laughs> what do sprinters? I, I like how you said this is non-religious. Like the others were really deep and spiritual, <laughs> right? You know, like. Yeah. <laughs> what do sprinters eat before a race? Nothing. They fast. <laughs> <laughs> Where do you learn to make ice cream? Sunday school. Oh. <laughs> that was religious. <laughs> Why do melons have weddings? Why? Because they can't elope. What do you call a snowman with a six-pack? An abdominal snowman. <laughs> what do you call the maple syrup with a speech impediment? Mrs. Stutterworth's. <laughs> Did you know that dogs can't operate MRI machines, but cats can? That's a good one. In King Arthur's court, did you know that there is a knight in charge of collecting the taxes? Mm -hmm. His name is Sir Charge. <laughs> did you know that there was another knight around that table, and his name was Sir Comference? <laughs> <laughs> did you just come up with that off the cuff right there? That was really good, man. I'm quick, man. I got the jokes. What, what do you call someone who gets really mad when they run out of bread? Lack, toast, intolerant. Speaking of bread, do you know what Darth Vader's favorite type of bread is? No. I, uh, I messed the joke up. <laughs> you can go back and start over. Nathan, can you edit that out later? After yeah, the well, okay. Let's see if I can remember this one. Here we go. How's it go? Oh, yeah. Do you know how Darth Vader likes his bread? How about how he likes his toast? <laughs> <laughs> no, I do not know how Darth Vader likes his toast. On the dark side. The dark side. On the dark side. That was side. a lot of work for one stupid joke. If sp <laughs> that was a lot of work for one laugh. If, if Spaghetti made an action movie, what would it be called? I don't know. Mission Impossible. 
Did you hear about the two television antennas that got married? No. Yeah, the ceremony was really boring, but the reception was great. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Did you hear about uh, the restaurant that they put on the moon? Great food, no atmosphere. <laughs> so most of you probably have heard this one before, but if you're American when you go into the restroom and you're American when you come out, do you know what you are when you're in the restroom? Euro European? European, yeah, <laughs> European. What do chicken coop, why do chicken coops only have two doors? Because if they had four doors, it would be a chicken sedan. Oh. All right, I've got three more here. Three more? How okay. many do you have? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what crime is a child guilty of when they refuse to take a nap? Hmm. Resisting arrest. Why did the coffee pot go to the police? Because it just got mugged. <laughs> How do you follow Will Smith? You know Will Smith, the actor, you know? Uh, Men in Black. Can't remember any other movies that he was in. <laughs> <laughs> How do you follow Will Smith in the snow? In the snow. If it's snowing and you're trying to follow Will Smith, how do you follow him? Mm -hmm. You follow the Fresh Prince. <laughs> You want to hear a joke about a stone? Never mind, I'll skip that one. Um, <laughs> how many ears does Captain Kirk have? He has three. A left ear, a right ear, and a final frontier. All right, this is the last one I have. What did dinosaurs use to pay their bills? Tyrannosaurus checks. <laughs> okay, last one for me. What type of magazines do cows read? Catalogs. Oh, come on, give it up for Pastor Eddie and Bad Dad Jokes.